the show analyzing real-life attacks step-by-step -step with Krav Maga and fitness expert, Olin Malul. Thank you, Adi. Hi. Hey. So let's jump right into it. Let's go. Okay, Adi, as you can see, this kind of a street fight gets already to the ground. There are two guys fighting, one on top of the other, headlocking him. Oh my and god. And probably his girlfriend or friends trying to help. <gasps> yeah. So now he's kind of on a mountain to him. Um, punches oh to god. the face. Again, the two girls here that are trying to help the guy who's being attacked. So this first scenario we have for this week is starting already on the ground. So first scenario we have a headlock. Yeah. Okay, what can we do from here? Oh, standing up. So there is actually a pretty effective technique. Uh, Leo, please come from here. There's actually a pretty effective technique that we could do. Headlock again. Up. Oh, we're on the ground. Yeah, headlock me strong. There you go. From here, first thing what I do, if this hand is free, is going to the groin. Okay, well a lot of time um, the, the one who's being attacked on the bottom is trying to do is kind of push him or use his force, right? What he doesn't pay attention, there are a couple of variable points here, like the groin, like the nose, right? So strike to the groin, strike to the groin. If this hand is captured in, so we are not going to start with a strike to the groin because my hand is captured, so I can go right away face, okay? Oh. From here, pay attention. If he has hair, I can go here. If not, nose, eyes. I prefer the nose, guys. From here, simply turning left. Pay attention. Oh, the other hand now can go out. Boom. Going, going. From here, I can flip him all the way around with my hips. Boom. Or just push him. Boom, legs. Standing up. Let's go for our first scenario. Yeah. Let's do it. To the ground. Bomb, headlock. So yeah, this scenario could also be if it's a lady being attacked, also an attempt for sexual assault. Anything like that that gets to the ground. So as we as we said, if this hand is free, always boom, look to the groin, the most yeah. venerable vulnerable point of a guy. Now, if this hand is actually captured there. Opa. Okay. Yeah, try to reach the groin now, not possible. Okay, yeah. But the other hand okay. would go first, right? Yeah. We started before with the groin, then face. Yeah. Now you're just gonna do it the opposite. Face. Okay. face. The moment you're gonna kind of boom, pull him back from the nose. Yeah, you have the space now. Yeah, go to again. Move the, to move the, my arm? Yeah. Okay. Oh yeah. Nose. You have ah, oh, you have the space. And now you can go groin, 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 groin. But this is not going to stop. He's always, or always going to grab. To keep my hands on. His face, okay. yeah. Keep your hands on. His face. Yeah, don't, don't be afraid to grab his eyes, nose. Okay. Yeah, strong. And now, groin, 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 groin. And now you can flip him. Now, so after your wins, groin, face, doesn't matter which order. Yeah. Right, let's do it. Boom, groin, 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 aggressive. Yeah, keep holding, keep holding. You're always going to keep holding this okay. one trying to really stretch his face as much as possible with the leverage, growing, growing. So after his day is kind of um, not with us anymore from here, if you're having a hard time to flip him, it's not must. Okay. You could just start pushing him with both hands towards this direction. Boop, right? Yeah, and with your hands, with your legs also. And pull him. And with your legs also, yeah, okay. You might ask yourself, come on, he's bigger than me, stronger than me, he's gonna get me to the ground, I'm gonna go to the nose. Okay, so, so what's gonna do? Nose, a little bit of pushing. So I'm gonna show you something, and you're gonna try it by yourself, okay. why this exact technique will actually work, even if you're smaller and the attacker is bigger and stronger, okay? So what we're gonna do now is a quick demonstration to show you why exactly this technique is going to help you save your life in this situation. Now, we're gonna have Leo okay. here, and what I'm gonna ask you to do is simply, I'm putting my hands here, simply walking through my hand towards this direction, as strong as you can, don't let me. Oh. 
Okay, one more time, Leo. Strong as possible. I'm also trying to stop you. Do you want to try? Yeah. Let's try it. Strong as you can, Leo. Just walk through. Right? So that's, a, that's impossible. Yeah. It's too so, big for us. <laughs> so is it possible to overcome someone bigger and stronger than you? If Let's you show see. me your trick. <laughs> so now I'm going to do the same thing, just with one finger. Leo, try to walk through. Try to walk. Yeah. Go, 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 go. Okay. So, <laughs> as you see, what we did there is we went and grabbed his nose. A weak spot. Okay, you're gonna do same thing. One finger <laughs> and up. <laughs> so you're able to stop his whole body, someone much bigger and stronger. And you'll be surprised because the same technique. Okay, can, when we're there. When you're down, yeah. you can also use when you're up. With the same technique you just did on the ground, yeah. if he's gonna headlock you up, right? You don't wanna let him take it to the ground because right. he wants. Yeah. What you're gonna do is just take a step with the right there to stabilize yourself. Yeah. And what's now? Now, go Strike to the groin, this end goes to the face, and take him off you. In reality, of course, you grab, it's and with the time. leverage, you can even put him to the ground. Uh -huh. Good job, Adi. Thank you, Owen. Thank you. Thank you guys for joining our Krav Maga class. You guys can stay tuned and check out our Facebook and YouTube page and learn more Krav Maga tips and lessons. Thank you.